hi welcome back to rebecca's travel so if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to rebecca's lifestyle hi how you all doing i hope everybody's as well as possible and um i hope everybody's having a good day or, or night wherever you are in the world and um, if you haven't subscribed to my travel and lifestyle channel please subscribe and big thumbs up and thank you for doing so um, I really appreciate it, it really helps my um, travel and my lifestyle channels um, out. So today I'm going to be doing Travel News UK 5 Exciting Facts March 2023 Part 3. So if you want to know more um, 5 Exciting UK Facts, please keep watching and a big thank you for doing so and uh, kicking off with number one the tele telegraph uh, is saying how to avoid travel chaos caused by um the weekend this weekend the m25 closure so that's um saturday and sunday at uh, this week um that's an entire stretch of mo motoring at closes for the weekend at uh, four travelers at, at mostly affected to heathrow and gatwick airports um so the travelers um that are traveling on the m25 between heathrow and gatwick airports uh, will be the most affected um and i'm just going to give you some uh, tips at uh, number one plan your route in advance and uh, number two read the traffic division uh, diversion signs or the division signs and um, they use your yellow and black signs t uh, telling you um what way to uh, travel on the roads and um allow extra time you uh, that's what you'll have to do um so you'll have to allow extra t uh, time and start your uh, journey earlier than intended um uh, go a different route um to get to your destination or try to go a different route instead of driving you can try another form of, of uh, transport public transport um, if possible to get to your destination like say taxis um, or um, say car sharing uh, public um, transport such as buses trains and um, over um and only travel um basically if you've got to for work etc and that'll cut the amount of traffic down on the roads and at uh, number two the daily express the beautiful little town that you've probably never even heard of and i haven't even heard of this town either um named one of the uk's best and it's called withenhoe in essex as the best place to live in the east of england and uh, there's lots to love about withenhoe um just it's just three miles from the city of colchester the town can be found on the banks of a uh, peaceful river cologne and um, with a population of just 7600 people in with with an o and with an o also has a calm about it it's nice and peaceful stunning pictures um, in the Daily Express and 
it has also an ideal spot for lovers of history and art and nature and walking so again it's um, a really good base to base yourself um, say uh, getting accommodation or if you're in a nearby city or a nearby a by town um, uh, go to Wyvern uh, Wyvern Ho on a day out and again it's a picturesque fishing town and uh, farmers smuggling hotspot oh sorry and sorry it's a fishing town and former smuggling hotspot and it's between uh, London and Norwich and um, it's bursting with an um, architectural um, charm and um, artistic spirit um, for the lover of uh, good food and drink there are plenty of places of choice um, in the form of riverside pubs tea rooms restaurants and the, the also the classic fish and chip shops uh, moving on to number three uh, travel weekly um, says Lock Mond Travel plans to bespoke tours to sell via agents UK and UK wide um, so they're going to be tailor made holidays um, around uh, Loch Lomond um, in Scotland or just sell, it's selling just tailor-made holidays in general uh, good luck to Loch Lomond uh, travel and I hope they uh, sell via their agents and obviously make a profit um, fingers crossed uh, for them number four is TTG travel um, in to travel to acquire UK tour operator within the next two weeks so I hope um, in to tell travel and um, gets their tour operators within the next uh, two weeks fingers crossed and last but not least the daily record UK holiday makers heading to Europe with pets I heard uh, to have the right documents you will have to have a separate document or documents uh, for um, any pets that you take with you so I would like to say thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow um, with two travel vi videos um, one of the brand new home bargain store that is um, currently being built and another one on best uh, budget travel tips uh, worldwide so please keep watching for that and have a as good day and night wherever you are in the world and thank you and bye for now thank you bye